y'all and welcome to my channel if you do not know my name is bonnie bray and thank you so much for taking time out of your day to join me so we are back with another video and welcome to a productive morning in my life so let's go ahead and get started i've already gotten dressed for the gym i'm ready to head out i'm going to take my dog outside for a walk first we're going to get his steps in and then i'm going to head on to the gym and then we'll come back to the house and we'll do some more stuff okay so if y'all are into lifestyle content and routines make sure to give this video a thumbs up subscribe down below and hit that post notification bell so you can be informed the next time that i upload a new video so let's get to it. y'all so we are back from the gym <laughs> so as y'all saw i went to the gym i just got out the shower and so now it's time to get into some skincare and so i've already done my first cleanse with the la roche pose purifying foaming cleanser which if you've been subscribed or following me you know that i absolutely love that cleanser and then so for my second cleanser i'm actually going to go in with the fresh soy face cleanser again if you've been subscribed like <laughs> For a minute now at least a year you've seen me use this product which I absolutely love so we're gonna use this for my second cleanse and then we'll continue on with the routine and we're just going to towel dry our face off Cause I'm not trying to be in here forever, okay? I'm trying to get out. <laughs> I'm like, I love doing my skincare, I really do, but I'm also like really hungry right now. And then, so now that our face is clean and dry, we're gonna use a clean cotton pad and the Indie Lee toner, another favorite, okay? If you're looking for like a nice hydrating toner, definitely try the Indie Lee. And then, so I'm putting this on a cotton pad just to make sure if there's any leftover residue or dirt we get that off and then also this is like super hydrating like i love this it has aloe and hyaluronic acid in it it is literally my favorite toner if y'all have been following me like i've been saying <laughs> i don't really change my products like that like that like i'll try new things but there are certain things that are like staples like that toner indy lee like i will have it forever like i already have another bottle of it because you have to like catch it when it goes on sale at ulta and if y'all are interested in sales and stuff like let me know that way i can make sure that y'all are hit for when it's time to purchase items when they're like half off because ulta often has like those types of sales and that's when i like to make sure that i'm <laughs> 
purchasing my items like that soy uh that fresh soy face cleanser i got on sale indie lead toner i buy on sale i literally have a whole nother bottle even though i had already paid full price for this one i was like oh wait it's on sale i'm getting it because i need to always have it the next we're going in with the myel uh pomegranate and honey revitalizing face serum now this stuff is my favorite so we're just going to put a few drops on my hand here my fingertips rub it in and then pat it on to our face like oh my gosh now this stuff is like my favorite serum like when you don't have time to do like every serum and like a whole 15 16 step routine like these serum uh blends are like where it's at and then I have another one that I'm kind of a fan of, well, I'm growing to be a fan of, but I'll share that with y'all at another time. But this one right here is like my absolute favorite. I also buy this when it's on sale. Granted, I think it's only like 14 bucks or like 15 bucks on their website, but uh, Mayel often does their um, $7 sale or their $8 sale. And whenever that sale comes up, like I always get a whole bunch. So like I have two more that are like unopened. <laughs> that I'm gonna use. Now I just have my little fan here to make sure that this is all absorbed in before we do our next steps, which should be fairly swift. So now we're gonna go in with the Indie Lee Toner one more time. This time we're gonna spray it directly onto our face. Oh my gosh, this stuff smells so good. And before this like dries and absorbs, we're gonna add our hyaluronic acid. Not hyaluronic acid. It, you could do hyaluronic acid, but this is actually snail music. <laughs> oh my gosh, like with products like hyaluronic acid or products like, um, like if you're using a hyaluronic acid serum, or if you're using like the snail mucin, you need to make sure that your face is damp. Like don't put this on dry skin. It won't be as effective, okay? Also, I always rub it into my hands too. But the way that my skin has made progress using this uh, snail mucin, like girl, like why aren't you? I know a lot of people like to use vegan products and this product is definitely not vegan. Honestly, this is the only product that I use in my skincare routine that's not vegan. Anywho, we're gonna let this dry in some more before we wrap up with our last step. So when you end <laughs> your skincare routine, like make sure you're putting on sunscreen. Like sunscreen is so important. Uh, before I go to the gym, I don't wash my face because like I don't want to like waste product But I do put on sunscreen because like, you know, I go out I walk my dog the gym can get sunny in there and We want to make sure that we are protecting our skin like if you have skin goals like if you're trying to um, Reduce the appearance of fine lines if you're trying to reduce like acne scars or even like prevent acne like make sure you are protecting your skin from the sun especially if you're trying to improve the look of your skin tone texture light and dark marks like you're not about to lighten any dark mark standing out in the sun like you can use any type of fancy serum but literally if you're not protecting your skin like what's the point like stop playing games typically the Sunscreen would be the last step, but I have like, I don't know if y'all can see, let me see if I can get close. I have like two little blemishes right there that are getting on my nerves. <laughs> um, it's literally only been like, I think it's been like a day, maybe two days. I think I really noticed it yesterday, but I'm going to use these Mario drying patches. If I can get them off with my nail. <laughs> oh, these nails sometimes be a blessing and a curse, Joe. So there's one. Oh, okay, we did it. <laughs> okay. All righty. So our skincare is done. And now I'm just ready to go put some clothes on so we can get in the kitchen, y'all. Because like I said before, your girl is hungry. Whew. And these four buns for the for my wash and go, like, 
the best. Like before I used to band my hair up in like a million sections and I feel like that was not the move <laughs> honestly because at night I wouldn't want to band it up and then also like it would be like too stretched sometimes in the center and then it would, yeah or mid strand I should say rather than center but um yeah the top is obviously like it was literally sprinkling so much over the weekend so this is like day today's Thursday so this is day six of the wash and go so it's not doing too bad um I'll make sure to link it down below but I did do a little short of how I did this wash and go style so if y'all are interested I'll be sure to link it it is one product okay one product which I have a video of on my channel from way back when it may be a little cringe so you know watch that at your own risk but i'll link that too in case you're interested <laughs> but anyways let me go put some damn clothes on so we can go eat because i'm hungry i'm hungry <laughs> I feel so much better because y'all like I was saying you girl was hungry okay so you know I made myself some grits and eggs and had a side of avocado with that so now I'm just going to do some cleaning stuff uh, before we wrap up the vlog uh, because my sister is coming into town so I do want to set up this room so that she can have a comfortable space so we're gonna do some laundry we're gonna clean the kitchen do some vacuuming and then we are going to call it a day well not call it a day but call it a morning <laughs> well wrap up the morning vlog anywho y'all you've been enjoying this video make sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe down below and hit that post notification bell so you can be informed next time i upload a new video and if y'all are enjoying the content or if there's other things that you want to see from me let me know down in the comments because listen there's more and more content coming. If there's something specific that you wanna see or if you have any questions about any of the products that I've used throughout this video, make sure to leave a comment and I will respond to y'all. So yes, anywho, let's go ahead and get to cleaning. Oh man, I feel like I'm always cleaning, that's all I do. Thank you. 
So it is time to go ahead and wrap up the video. If y'all enjoy my productive morning routine, this morning vlog, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe down below, and hit that post notification bell so you can be informed next time that I upload a new video. And I will see y'all in the next one. Bye. Thank you.